looking into it? Or are you kind of On her way home from Cedar Point with her mom, 14-year-old Angie Bowman couldn't believe her eyes. She snapped pictures of a large black and white dog riding in the back of a pickup with no tailgate on Route 2. And the dog was fidgeting around and it just looked so uncomfortable. And then it looked at me when we drove by and that broke my heart. The truck was going about 60 miles an hour. Angie told me the dog was tied in the bed. Still, she felt this was animal cruelty. It's nuts to me to think that somebody could do something like that to their animal. I just, if you, man's best friend, why would you tie him up like that? The teen worried the dog could still fly out of the vehicle, be dragged and killed or even endanger the lives of highway drivers. What if the dog flew off or jumped off and then hit somebody's car or went through the windshield? She called the state highway patrol and found out what Stark County dog warden John Barber already knew. Currently, there are no laws that specifically deal with an animal in an open vehicle like that. Ohio law prohibits people under 16 from riding in an unenclosed or unroofed cargo area of a vehicle traveling faster than 25 miles per hour. But the law doesn't apply to animals. I think that, you know, there should be laws, and I, you know, I would encourage anyone who feels there's things like this going on to contact their local legislators. Angie is keeping her concerns alive on social media, posting multiple pictures of the dog in the pickup on her Facebook page. I hope that something can be changed, that people shouldn't be able to do stuff like that to their animals.